the next error we have is the error of original entry now this error occurs when the double entry of a transaction is completed correctly but using the wrong amount in both accounts so for this error it deals with the wrong amount let's have a look at an example bought goods by debit card 469 dollars this transaction was recorded in the books as six hundred and forty million dollars so you can see there the two amounts are different now let's have a look at how this was recorded purchases was debited with 640 and the bank was credited with 640 and not with 460 we need to rectify this so we will correct this error in the general journal First again we write the date, but we need to take note of the following. That the amount you need to put in will be the difference between the two amounts. So it will be the difference between the 640 and the 460. And that amount will be 180. So we need to first record the debit entry, which is bank 180. And note again it's the difference between the two amounts and then we need to credit purchases with the same amount of 180 and our narration will be goods bought for 416 million dollars recorded in the books as 614 million dollars error now corrected let's have a look at our ledger now, how this was recorded in our general ledger is as follows. Purchases was debited with 640 and bank was credited with 640, but it should be 460 for both accounts. So now we need to correct this. Well, we'll do this by only posting the difference, which is 180 for purchases on the credit side and for bank on the debit side purchases is an expense and our expenses decrease on the credit side and our bank is an asset and our assets increase on the debit side let's have a look at how this will affect our trial balance in our incorrect trial balance we have a bank balance of 640 on the credit side and a balance of 640 for purchases on the debit side and even though this error was not corrected our trial balance balances let's have a look at our corrected trial balance well we will debit our bank with 180 which would give us the correct total for bank which is 460 and then we would create our purchases with 180 in order to obtain a debit balance of purchases for 460 and after we've corrected the error our trial balance still balances so both the incorrect trial balance and the trial balance after we did the corrections still balances let's move on to the next error 